Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. Breaking Defense reported that South Korea is presenting its K-9 Thunder self-propelled howitzer to the U.S. Army. This offer aims to address the capability gap resulting from the cancellation of the U.S. Army's Extended Range Cannon Artillery ERCA, program. Initiated in 2015, the ERCA program was designed to significantly enhance the range and lethality of the U.S. Army's field artillery systems. The ambitious project aimed to develop advanced cannon systems capable of firing artillery shells over extended distances with improved precision, thereby providing more effective support for ground forces. The primary platform for ERCA was based on the M109A7 Paladin Integrated Management PIM, chassis, which incorporated modernized fire control systems, advanced targeting optics, and digital communication systems. Despite its promising goals, the ERCA program faced significant technical challenges during its prototyping phase. Relaunched in 2018 with an objective to extend artillery range to 70 kilometers, the program encountered severe wear and tear on the cannon after relatively few rounds, leading to its termination despite initial testing successes. Consequently, the U.S. Army has shifted its focus to evaluating existing artillery systems to fulfill its long-range needs. To this end, $55 million has been allocated in the FY25 budget to identify and implement suitable extended-range cannon solutions. Developed by South Korea's Hanwha Defense and introduced in 1999, the K-9 Thunder is currently employed by several countries, including South Korea, Turkey, Poland, India, Finland, Norway, and Estonia. This self-propelled howitzer is equipped with a 155mm-52 caliber gun, capable of firing conventional rounds up to 40 km and rocket-assisted projectiles up to 50 km. It features advanced fire control systems, automatic ammunition handling, and enhanced mobility, making it a formidable asset in modern artillery operations. In light of the ERCA program's cancellation, the U.S. Army has announced its intention to rely on existing systems for long-range artillery capabilities. In a proactive move, Hanwha Defense is preparing to demonstrate the K-9 Thunder for the U.S. military. This showcase, which may take place in Seoul or at the Yuma Proving Ground in Arizona, underscores Hanwha Defense's readiness to step in and fill the gap left by the discontinued ERCA program. The cancellation of the ERCA program marks a significant shift in the U.S. Army's approach to enhancing its artillery capabilities. By evaluating existing systems such as the K-9 Thunder, the Army aims to address its long-range artillery needs more effectively. South Korea's offer to showcase the K-9 Thunder demonstrates a commitment to supporting the U.S. military and highlights the potential for international collaboration in strengthening defense capabilities. That's all for now. See you later.